What's going on guys? This is Dr. Jared Hall here, physical therapist in Fort Worth, Texas. And I wanted to do this post in honor of National Physical Therapy Month. It is October and that is National Physical Therapy Month. And the longer I practice, the more I realize the general public and our patients don't have a good understanding of really what we do. Um, so what I wanted to do was answer the question, what is a physical therapist? So as I referred to myself earlier in this video, a physical therapist in the United States does have a doctorate education. Um, a lot of people aren't aware of this, but the, the education is pretty rigorous and involves a lot of medical background, anatomy, physiology, and uh, pain management, as well as various neurological management and um, a general understanding of the human body, health, sickness, disease processes, and all of that. Um, a lot of people don't realize that physical therapists also have several different clinical specialties. So going on past just graduating with their doctorate, they might be an orthopedic specialist, a sports specialist, a women's health specialist, a neuro, pediatric, geriatric, cardiovascular, or even neurophysiologic specialist. So these specialists have gone on into extensive training to further their education and become a highly skilled practitioner in their respective areas. A lot of people also don't realize that physical therapists are considered to be one of the prime conservative pain management specialists. So when we look at various medical guidelines for several conditions such as back pain, shoulder pain, knee pain, various subtypes of these issues, we see that physical therapy is the first line recommendation for almost all of these conditions because we have such a good track record of helping these people out. And physical therapists are one of the most highly educated healthcare um, practitioners related to the topic of pain. Uh, pain is a very complex topic and you want to be treated by somebody that has a thorough understanding and knowledge of pain to help you move through whatever you're working on right now and get out of your painful condition. A lot of people also don't realize that physical therapists practice in a variety of settings. So you might see a physical therapist, of course, in an outpatient orthopedic setting where you come in either before or after a surgery or if you've strained your neck or your back or maybe if you have some balance issues and things like that. But physical therapists also work in hospital settings. They work in nursing homes. They work in home health. They work in neurological rehabs. They work with pediatrics and pediatric rehabs. And they also work in school systems as well. There's a variety of places that you'll see a physical therapist working because we are so highly trained in a variety of areas. And finally, what I wanted to do is end off this message by asking everybody that's viewed this video to pass it around, to share it, to encourage their friends and family and the general public to watch this video so that we can get the message out about what a physical therapist truly is. So if you guys have any questions, please comment below and I hope you have an awesome day and enjoy National Physical Therapy Month. Thank you.